Hey guys, it's Nick from Simplify ERP. In this new chapter of guides, I'll show you an easy way of managing a checklist and creating and managing an auto-based website. Let's jump in straight to the tutorial. Okay, so you should probably watch the previous videos that we made on this topic about the marketing automation, how to make a template, how to make target, how to target specific audience, obviously, how to check analytics and all of the things connected within marketing automation. But in this video, I'm going to show you how you can manage these drip funnels, which are really cool. Depend if you send a drip campaign to someone and you want to have specific actions, aka funnels that we call that offer support to your campaign, which means if you send out an email and you want another action to send out, which is what should happen if someone clicks on a link or what should happen if someone opens an email or maybe what should happen if someone doesn't reply to the mail. So in these cases, I'm going to show you how to do that right now. We already have set this test campaign that we have in the previous videos. So I'm, I'm into edit right now. You can see on the top left, you go into edit. And here we have several activities that we added for this campaign. So for, for example, I'm going to add a new activity. I'm going to call it first mail. I'm going to choose a template. After one hour after beginning of campaign which means this is the first email that sets up. So on this, we're gonna add a child activity. We need to go to save, go to edit again, and now we're gonna add a child activity. So I'm gonna make another mail if someone opens it. I'm gonna do another test after sending first mail. After mail open, you see this on the trigger on the right side, it means what should happen after how many hours of the mail being opened? So I'm going to do it after one day of someone opening my mail. I want them to receive another mail. So after activity first mail, this is a second test after sending first mail. I'm going to save and close. And then on that one, I'm going to save it again. Now I'm going to go into edit again. Now I'm going to add what if someone doesn't open the mail. I'm going to do if someone doesn't open mail i'm gonna choose a test template obviously you can customize these templates by yourself here in this process i'm just gonna show you how this thing works so you can understand and make a better picture for this tool itself because this is one of the best marketing tools that auto version 14 offers and i'm sure a lot of you will find this valuable so this is how our template looks like I don't have to change anything. And this is if someone doesn't open mail. Now I'm going to add if someone replies. I'm going to choose another template. Also, you can have all of this fully, which means what, what should happen if the email bounces, if it never gets sent, depending on a person. What if someone clicks on a link? What if they don't click on a link? What if they reply or don't reply? You can have this fully set up within Oru. And that's why this makes the marketing automation a really cool feature that Oru have. Has your business outgrown the standard Shopify functionality and you're having to load up your shop with lots of apps? Then it is time to think about centralizing your business in Oru and using Shopify as a sales frontend. And remember, our team is based in Eastern Europe and we offer consulting and support in English and German. Don't forget, check out our YouTube and Vimeo channels, we post every single day from Monday to Friday, 11am. Much valuable content pieces are being uploaded. Of course, subscribe to our YouTube channel and leave like on the videos that helped you work around your way around the problems you might have faced using Oru. For more tutorials and guides, make sure to check out our websites at simplify-erp.com and simplify-erp.de. Also, check out our pages on social media under simplify erp including LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Thank you for watching. See you again in another video.